Hi, I'm Nick Jeffers of New Projects. And as you know, we are West London's number one design and build construction company. And over the last sort of six months, we're getting a lot of people coming to us saying, who does our digital marketing, especially the paid ads? So this chap over here, Matty, he is now uh, been with us for how long? It's nearly a year now. A year? Mm. You sure? Yeah, it's been eight months. Eight months. months. So uh, Matty came on board with us as a, he started off as an intern and we were just to get his, you know, a feel for the business and learning about, you know, how we do things, you know, my, uh, my men, not mentality, my why ethos. Didn't, why didn't you tell them about the interview? When no, I no, but yeah. oh yeah, what, the, the interview. Whole, how, I, how I got started here. So basically when Matty first came in for the job, he, he was probably one of 10. And um, on day one, I had three people come in. They'd never had the X Factor. Uh, on day two, two more came in. No, I was getting pretty disheartened. And on day three, we had um, two people booked in. One was Claudia and one was Matty. Now, when Claudia came in, I was, um, I had with me um, Tess, who was my PA at the time, and we were interviewing uh, interns to take over our social media in-house. And um, in walks Claudia. So straight away, me and uh, Tess looked at each other. She looked great. She had the X Factor already. And um, after the interview, after a few minutes, we just knew by her personality and her, her track record and what she was doing, she was the one. We thought this girl has got the X Factor. Tess, you may now leave, uh, new, and we've got a perfect replacement. So that was that. We said, thanks, uh, Claudia, we'll let you know. Then about an hour later, in walks Matty like a mini Grant Cardone. So anyone knows Grant Cardone, it was him, like an 18 year old boy strutting in. This job's mine. <laughs> I, was I so, need I was this 17, job. 17 at the time. I was 17 it? at a time. And I, th I looked at Tess and I thought, who the hell is this boy? Mm. So full of energy, full of fire, entrepreneurial spirits. You know, he all, he, you know, he was running uh, his own little business uh, for, um, teenagers in nightclubs and he was making a bit of money on the side and the side hustle so um, we were in a major dilemma so after Matty disappeared um, me and Tess said look what are we gonna do and I said you know what I've got to find a way of bringing both of these on board straight away so I ended up hiring uh, uh, Claudia who takes care of our uh, uh, Instagram and Facebook and natural uh, uh, articles and LinkedIn. And also Matty was brought on board to um, help Claudia and also take care of paid ads. So here we are, this is Matty. Um, and as I said, we get so many people coming to us now asking me who takes care of our ads on social media, our Instagram ads and our Facebook ads. Well, it's Matty. So on the back of this, we're, we've launched New Digital to take care of, obviously, my projects for new, because we need content creation all the time at scale, and also for our clients who are watching us and following our progress on uh, social media. So um, Matty, just tell everyone, you know, a bit, little bit about you yeah. and, you know, what you can do for like a business who wants to grow their brand awareness. Yeah. Um, so before I started working for Nick, I actually, I was doing my GCSEs, end up going to college for two months and just decided it wasn't for me. Didn't end up wanting to do my A-level. So I ended up leaving college, started working for Nick. I've been, I was doing my events company on the side, but the main thing that I wanted to go into was marketing. So I've been learning, I was doing, learning through Grant Cardone, through, basically people mm. in the marketing industry. And I was learning to run paid Facebook ad advertisement. 
Um, and then that's when obviously I came across Nick. But you did this course, that you went on a course to learn? Oh yeah, so I was doing I had like a mentor, I was doing a few courses, yeah. and then, yeah, so obviously I came across Nick. We've been doing his paid advertisement for like, what, 10 months now? Yeah. And then we but both- it's, it's just like, it's like a mixture. It's, 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 it's normal posting at scale. Yeah, so, so what, obviously what it is, I've been doing Nick's social media management, but the paid ads, so it's Facebook and Instagram ads. And what it is, is basically, it's a way of targeting specific people and be able to get in front of that audience yeah. and obviously get them to we get exactly. leads from that and i've been getting nick basement projects yeah loft conversion projects because what, what most people don't realize is you know they're hitting the boost button all the mm. time aren't they they're boosting it and that just goes out to a wide audience yeah, which no, you know which you know make your ad spend really high that's yeah, the thing so people they don't realize obviously when you're running professional ads on facebook people will go onto Instagram, they'll waste a whole load of money by boosting that post, but that's not how you, you run it through a Facebook business manager. And that's what I've obviously been learning to do for the past yeah, and, and two depends, years. you know, for us new projects, mm. we're interested in the business in Fulham, Chelsea, Belgravia, you know, within the yeah, radius exactly. of one or two miles. So that's why you have to target specific areas. So on our latest ads we're running now, mm -hmm. how, how many have we got, two, three? So we're, at the moment, when you first start running ads, you always test a few different ones. At the moment, we've got probably about three different ads. Yeah. One for interior design, one for just basements, yeah. because we do specialize in just basements. Yeah. And then we've got one that's more design and build, it's a bit more, bit and, broader. And how many eyeballs are we getting on that ad per week? So each, each ad, so imagine it's a basement ad, we'll get probably about 40 to 50 leads just a month, just from that. Yeah. Um, yeah. And then we get the same. Because it's not worth ones. that basement ad going out to thousands of people. Oh, no. It needs to be pinpointed in certain we areas. We target Knightsbridge, Fulham, we target yeah, the primaries. And, primary it and, and it also, it doesn't, it needs to be targeted to people of a certain age in a yeah, certain exactly. bracket. Because we're, we're not going to want to target 20 year olds. Well, they, they exactly. They're the basement. Exactly. So, you know, I do paid ads not really to close the sale, mm. but to build the brand, brand yeah, awareness. Brand, so brand everyone awareness. can see my face saying how wonderful new projects is. Mm. They see the logo all the time. So every time someone picks up their phone, if they can see an ad of me saying how wonderful new projects is, and mm. we're talking about our, our services, interior design, architecture, you know, basements, whatever. The, so the reach from the ads I've been running for Nick, we've hit nearly a quarter of a million people. And a quarter of a million people, yeah. that's, just these prime areas. Yeah. That's so, you know, lots of people who are following us, we've probably got within a week, 10 to 15 interested businesses mm. who want you to run their campaigns. Yeah. Um, so what's, what's the sort of process? You know, they can, they can contact you. Yeah, so obviously I've got, you can get in touch with me, matty at nudigital.uk or obviously call the office 020 7731. 6841 and then the process obviously getting set up is you log into your Facebook business manager I send a whole load of the process is pretty easy I send a whole an hour of footage of me talking and it takes you step by step so I can get started straight away and you basically make me partner on your Facebook business manager so exactly. it's just a simple way of and, doing it, and it all depends what the product is mm. or the brand they want to sell exactly. uh, will sort of uh, justify the ad spend, mm. isn't it? Yeah, no, exactly. Um, and the process to, from the first call into the, the initial ad going live, it could be quite quick, really, couldn't it? Oh, it can be. Very quick. It just quick. all depends if the ad gets approved. Yeah, no, exactly. Uh, and that's why we're doing lots, we, you know, me, my ads work better when I'm speaking. Yeah, for sure. You know, so, um, you know, the more video we do is the better, mm. uh, but some people may just want a still image or uh, a video of the product rather than them speaking. Yeah. But we can take care of the video as well because yeah, no, obviously exactly. we work with an entrepreneurial videographer, yeah. uh, Zoltan, and mm -hmm. as you know, he's probably behind the camera now filming. <laughs> Hi Zoltan. <laughs> and uh, you know, if, if the clients want videos taken and recorded, mm. we will put them in contact yeah, with Zoltan. I, there's a lot of clients that I've come across within the last few weeks, they just haven't got any content. Exactly. And I can't run ads without and, content. And the so. old the old phrase is just content is king. For sure. You know, do not consume as much, you wanna create it at mm. scale. So um, yeah, so anyone out there wants their business promoted, through new obviously we're a trusted brand we're based on the fulham high street and again all you've got to do is contact matty 
6841 or uh, send them an email. Um, not a problem. So, uh, Matty, thanks a lot. No problem. And um, let's smash it. Look forward to speaking to you soon. Thanks. See you later. Bye-bye.